so much for joining us. I'm Morgan OTA alongside Kyle Peel. Now you may have heard there is a 90 cent cone sale <laughs> underway now at Whitey's Ice Cream. Yeah, you may have heard that a time or two <laughs> this week. Well, it's in celebration of Whitey's 90th anniversary. And joining us now is Whitey's, Vice, uh, Whitey's Ice Cream Vice President, Annika Thunberg. Annika, first of all, congratulations. <laughs> yes. Thank you. I we know, are very happy to make it to 90. And I, yeah. I know you're very busy. You were just on the phone <laughs> about 10 minutes ago or so. <laughs> busy very lady. busy. And you know, Whitey's was founded in Moline back yes. in 1933, so 90 years. Talk nice. about your special you've had this week, the 90 cent cones. Yes, 90 cent cones. So as you mentioned, if you haven't heard, which I know a lot of people have, <laughs> they have. <laughs> stores have been busy. Yeah. But yes, yeah, so we have 90 cent cones this week just to celebrate and as a way to say thank you and give back to the community for having, you know, supported us and been there for us for over the last 90 years. So definitely a popular item this week, I can confirm, but we, um, we're, it's great to see all the people in the stores and just really embracing the sale and embracing Whitey's. Yeah, it's not really tough to get people in the door at any <laughs> Whitey's location, so, yeah. that is for sure, but um, it's kind of a really cool way that you guys are also saying thank you to the community, yeah. which is awesome because it's your birthday. Yeah. Um, and in celebration of that, yes. talk about what you've got here. So we always do our treat of the month and we couldn't let this month pass without, you know, paying homage to of course not. our 90th birthday. Yeah. Yeah. So we have our birthday cake shake, which is a regular on the menu, but of course we had to we spruce it up with some red and white sprinkles, sprinkles for the month. It. So it's oh, a pretty delicious shake if you haven't tried one yet. Can I try it? Absolutely. Those are for you guys. Oh, so oh, so thank you. This I've is had the my fair share, so you can take those. So we've got <laughs> chunks of cake in it too? No chunks of cake. It's oh, just okay. our cake just batter flavoring. Okay. And then oh it has the sprinkles inside and on top. Mm. Yep. Oh. Can <laughs> confirm this is delightful. Now, during the break, you were asking Kyle Dickens what his favorite flavor yes. of ice cream was. I have to ask, what's what's your favorite? I missed the conversation on that. Mm. <laughs> As I uh, As you swallow eat this birthday ice cream. cake. This yeah, is birthday cakes good. is his new favorite. So. Yeah. No, my, so my favorite <laughs> scoop of ice cream, I would have to say, is cotton candy. Uh, Ooh. Yes. I mean, just just. Pretty basic little kid. <laughs> the little kid in me loves a cotton candy. Admittedly, but more adults I feel like get cotton candy yeah. than really? kids, so you're in good company. All right, but my my go-to that I've always gone to is just a simple chocolate Oreo malt. Can't, Can't go, go wrong. No. No. Yeah. No. yeah. How about you? Um, Graham Central Station. Uh, the first popular. time I ever had it was I was living in Iowa City going to University of Iowa and some of my friends were like, you've got to try this ice cream. I'm like, Graham crackers? I don't even like Graham crackers. <laughs> it is the best ice cream ever. Ever. I that will tell anybody one. that. I love well, it. Well, admittedly, so our number one seller is actually our vanilla ice cream, which, you know, oh, goes yeah. in a lot of things. Right. Sundays. It's a good exactly. staple. Exactly. Yeah. Staple. But then Graham's actually our number two seller at our store, so there you're you not far off on loving Graham. I love to hear that. Oh, and you yeah. brought some with you. I know, yeah. just to tempt you a little bit. Yeah, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> okay, we, we have to talk about the swag, yes. too. The 90th yeah. anniversary swag. swag. You know, we couldn't let it go without um, having some merchandise for everybody to commemorate the, the 90th yeah. birthday with. So we have our coffee cup, a canvas tote bag, and a sweatshirt available for sales in our stores and online. Yeah, this is really cool. Uh, you're going to want to get your hands on this, especially I feel like if you were born in this community or, you know, this is home to you, yeah. that Whitey's is, is home to you yeah. as well. So it's really cool to get your hands on some of these really special yeah. things like this. No, and, you know, it's great to see people. I was working in one of the stores the other day, and the whole store started singing happy birthday to Whitey's while in the store. It's really awesome. been fun to yeah. see um, everybody really just get excited about the week and just, you know, wishing Whitey's a happy birthday, and yeah. we're so thankful for that. Very cool. Well, some other things that people will find in stores are those cardboard cutouts that we were yes. just talking about. <laughs> So kind of explain for people that are walking in what they yeah, might see. Yeah, so, you know, our, our uniforms back in the day, yes. they've evolved a little bit. Yeah. But back in the day, the they were white pants, white tops, or the red and white striped apron. Mm -hmm. So we decided it would be kind of fun to give people a chance to kind of experience the old uniform. So we have fun cardboard cutouts in our stores right now where you can stand behind to get your picture taken with your yeah. cone or, you know, whatever props you choose to bring. But yeah. they're just kind of a fun way to, uh, mm. you know, have a little fun in the stores while you're yeah. waiting in line. And speaking of the throwbacks, I saw on social media the other day, you all posted, yeah. um, you actually just got your hands on yes. the original Whitey sign oh, from yeah. the first store. Yeah. How did how did that come about? So it's actually, it was a sign from our stores from the 50s to about okay. late 70s when that mm -hmm. store was torn down. So, um, so uh, a man had, um, my grandfather, Bob, had given him the sign mm -hmm. when we were tearing down the store, said, you know, if you can get it, it's all yours. And so he has been taking care of it, taking 
taking care of it for us for 44 years. Wow. And, you know, I think that um, he saw we were celebrating our 90th and just wanted to make sure we had that for our history. I don't know what we're going to do with it yet, but stay tuned. It looks <laughs> yeah. really cool. Yeah, it is pretty cool. neat. It's a really fun piece of memorabilia to have. Very cool. Well, uh, lots of memories there at Whitey's among so many people in this community. Again, mm -hmm. there are a variety of ways that you can participate in the Whitey's Ice Cream 90th Anniversary Celebration. 90 cent cones this week. Uh, merchandise is for sale. You just saw some of it here on the show. And uh, so is that delicious birthday cake yes. shake. <laughs> Annika, thank you, thank so, you much. so much. And thank you guys for having us. Yes. And um, great to see you both. And, you know, hopefully we'll see you in another 90. Absolutely. <laughs> we'll be there. <laughs> well, coming up next on Quad Cities Live, it's grilling season. So we're headed to the TV6 kitchen for some expert grilling advice from hy V. And in your community calendar, a first-of-its-kind car show is set for tomorrow at the Tangled Wood in Bettendorf. Concourse to Quad Cities starts at 8 a.m. This is a family-friendly event with proceeds going to the Friends of the Bettendorf Parks Foundation. To participate, you do not have to register ahead of time. Just show up. And a reminder, you can see more local events on our website and mobile app. You can share your events there as well.